whole field with your boys know it's been a drill All these hoes want the same thing like a sending it down And it's chain rings a Q&A video, Q&A questions. Um, I posted on my Instagram what type of questions y'all want me to answer and I'ma just read the questions and I'ma just answer y'all questions, okay? I just need y'all to stay tuned. Now, is y'all ready? Is y'all ready? All right, let's go. Number one on the list, it says, have I met anyone famous before? Okay, the only two, pe the only two people I would say I have met was Malala and Zami. Went to, but my best friend has it. I know she has it. She's got to send it to me. But I only met two famous people, like face to face wise. Um, nothing really major, nothing really major. But I did meet Mulatto and I did meet Zani, and that was the only two famous people that I know of. Says the next question says, Would I like to be famous? Um, I honestly don't care about the fame, y'all. Really do not, because that means that we are human. We all human, we all do the same things, like, it's nothing different, but, um, now yeah, I really don't care for being famous. It's not, like, something I have to be, something that has to be done. It is what it is. It is what it is. Next question says, if I could change one thing that happened to the world or me, what would it be? Well, with, for the world, I probably would change slavery, because that took a tremendous a toll on our world and it's still going on to this day with racism and things like that so i would say slavery not just only that it's just everything everything that's going on with this world right now i would change it but myself i probably wouldn't change anything about myself everything i wanted to change has changed and i love the person that i am today so that's all that matters okay this right. question it says if i could live anywhere else in the world where would it be um y'all anywhere tropical Anywhere that is not cold, anywhere that can serve me fruity drinks, I can walk out with a day, uh, bathing suit, bikini, anything like that. That's where I want to move to. That's where I want to move to. But yeah, any any place that is tropical, somewhere with the sun out, and I can do whatever I want to do. You understand? So yes, anywhere tropical, that's probably where I would want to live. Next question is says, Have I ever had sex on the beach? No, I have never had sex on the beach. I don't know how that is like. I'm thinking about it, y'all. I'm thinking about doing this shit. I ain't never did it before, but I'm thinking about it. So, but now I ain't never had sex on the beach. That's something I probably would do. But yeah, I ain't never, I never done it. If you done it, comment down below and tell me how it is. The next question it says beach, city, or mountains. I'll say the city. Probably. Probably the city because the beach. I I get look. I get tired of the beach too much. Like I really would get tired of the water feel. Like I get tired of the beach too quickly. But don't get me wrong, it's a beautiful place. But I couldn't live there. Mountains, um, oh, it's cold. I don't know where we're cold. Uh, uh city. They got everything I need. They got all the fast food places. They got all the little um shopping areas. They got everybody down. You get what I'm saying? It's a fun time in the city. But if you're away from the things, it's just like, what else can you do? But yeah, I'll say the city. Next question, it says, have I ever cried at a movie scene? Yes, I have cried at a movie scene, y'all. And it's just a regular one. I, I said it before a while ago on my own videos. I was watching the Pixar Disney movie with my niece. And it was inside out. And a little memory ball was disappearing. I think his name was Bing Bong or something like that. He was disappearing. He died in a little memory ball. And I cried, y'all. I did cry. I don't understand. Like, I felt so bad. But that was a while ago, but that was just an example. That's not the only one, that's not the only movie I have cried over, but that's the one I could I already told y'all about. So yeah, that's the that's the one. Question it says, who said I love you first? Me or my boyfriend? Um my boyfriend told me he loved me first. I think. I think. I don't know. We say we love we, we say we love each other so much to each other. I don't even know who said it first. But um I think he did. I think he did, but at the end of the day, that's still my baby. I don't care. I would have said it first if I didn't say it first, shit. But it really don't matter because at the end of the day, we both tell each other that we love each other. So it's not a big deal. Okay. Alright. Pisses me off. It's a lot of things that pisses me off. Um, fake people, um, what else pisses me off? Talking over me, um, trying to be funny, like all those things piss me off. Just don't piss me off, y'all. And I got a whole video. If y'all have not seen the things that piss me off video, think out this video real quick. Go watch it and that'll answer your question. That'll answer your question. Okay. All right. Last question on this video. It says, how many fights have I been in? 
Only, only been in two fights that I can think of. Only two fights, like physical, boom, boom, like real fights that I felt like was real, real. You know, not no little cat scratch, not no little back and forth bickering. But yeah, anyway, I don't like to fight y'all, but people be trying me. And I'm like, I'm shocked I only been in two fights. I'm shocked I only been in two fights, but you know, that's a good thing. That's how y'all know I do not do that drama. I don't do that drama, man. So. So that was in my video. Hope y'all like it. I want y'all to like, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff. You know I love you. Bye, hoes.